do you leave me hanging like that? You know, I can't do it alone. It's technology. <laughs> if I said it, you're going to fight me. So I'm not saying anything. Don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say it. <laughs> right? And it did. <laughs> Brother, what do you want to say? Bajome Hoye. Yeah, some um and I will be traveling between US and Ghana. Okay, so I'm chatting with this sister. How do mm -hmm. you pronounce her name? Is it Se Seneva? Uh, yes. Uh, you are pronouncing it, I don't know. Yeah. Uh we will travel between the Ghana and eventually settling in Ghana. Okay, since let me know because you know what we can hang out. Hang out. Okay, because you know, I can deal with Americans and my brother will fight me, but you guys we fight and we move on. <laughs> you African American. Yes, email me, says email me. All right. So um brother, we have some people that don't speak to you here. So today I'm in trouble. So okay. we're gonna miss. <laughs> So, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you, thank brother. You. Thank you. I miss you so much. Yes, yes. We're looking for you. Yes. <laughs> and um, I always want to talk to you, but you know how life happens. And you yesterday, I heard you saying that, oh, in Ghana, there's, um, there's no stress, peace of mind. And I type on my phone when I was watching you live, I type on my phone to post like I was chat I was trying to say that I am not worried about anything but my blood pressure is high. <laughs> but that is not mm -hmm. <laughs> I decide not to send it to you because I know as soon as I send you gonna you see you see <laughs> Mm -hmm. So you said Ghana is peace of mind, and it's so true. So thank you for always sharing ideas and making us feel like we need to come back home. And please, if you are here, you don't know Mr. Obenda Akon. Um, he's not a YouTuber, he's an advisor, and he mm. and right, <laughs> and he posted on YouTube for us to get some info, some of his brain. So Guys, you better go search for him or Ben Dako and you will find his videos beautiful. Nice, nice advice. So thank you, bro. Thank you, madam. Yeah, thank you for coming. Can you introduce yourself to us, please? Okay. Um, my name is Kobna Obinda. I'm a, an African Ghanaian. I train as an engineer. I'm an entrepreneur. Um, we are into real estate development, construction, fashion retail. Uh, we live in Ghana, so that's mainly what we do. Yeah. Yeah. And we are passionate about uh, the development of our people and our people becoming successful and living to the best of what the Creator uh, has given us. You know, and that's what uh, we share. Thank you, bro. So, guys, those who don't speak to you, today I'm going to mess it up because I have some things that I want to say, ask brother, and I want to talk about, the, uh, talk about, and if I say it in English, it's going to turn into something else. So wait for me. <laughs> wait for me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you don't, I'm going to say it in, in my language and my brother is going to mess it. We're going to mess it, right? Bra? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yes. So my big problem for the past three videos that I've made, you know, mm -hmm. now I was talking about one, how Ghanaians, we are so negative, brother, so yeah. negative. It, somebody can be in church from mm -hmm. day one. I won't have a sister. I mean, I'm going to make us a woman who was sorry, no, mom, I met target because I mm -hmm. used to be in church every Sunday. When we be born, pray a pa. When we be quiet, sorry, I only pray a lie. When we net so or hobby, we friend on net. Now we catch them and say, "Oh, me saying, can we go to church? I see we walk on, you know. Yes, we say, I never bought it. I want my son. 
what narrative story ni nyina eh hwe da bi da bi da bi hwe wo ani awo ye kwa ma ofie fu ohun o ma we hu chese be ye obon tam um negativity kwa tim na me ye video na me ka se eni pa ti eni pa wo dwene no sa na wo te e na bible kwa kita ye no se se um so o o o o do e papa na papa ba wa kwa mu asa asa bibi e ti and i'm saying you are what you eat also na a lot of people agree with me na ya na sane ma sane me dey attach it to um success in life in life o bi bia na me nim no abrada wo ye successful in life no wo ye positive person absolutely wo bi bia na me nim no hwe me ta ka me nua girl o di machi mi enu what in his store no na so be jina ho se wo preach ya otimi ka che so ko wachi enya sa se obi e peso o run store mu na wo ye de de no wo ye so fo o be ka che so please move 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 because i have to pay my bills on two kwai da so wo hu se wo ton ade na so ti na be na wo twi mi enu na wo twi mi ensa wo hu na se bi a wan se wa wo hu na wo se oh where have you been me hu wa che so oh me compile bo wa was a woman to ade e bi wo che wa ade e si ho wo beto ade na wanya sika no wo kwa wo kwotena ba bi abompaye wow because we believe in we believe in say aduma ding any focus a wo ba ye no eno mo mbetunya yi ama wo shira ba wa kwa mu esene say wo ba kwa kwotena sori de na ya na meta no kasa wo ta ka bibi say eni eh gana ni ba ye aduma ding no and I see ya, um, ya preacher tell me say that say ya obey ya dumaden no ya se bompa ya na abe ye. Na sa se mo me juno 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 ti se me no kasa bi ana sa oko me se brother ya kasa se mo. Na wo e futu obi pa fa ma ma e ma e na di e me ba ma ma me ba ma ye nu ya no ma obi e ti mi e ti ti mo pa be dru America ha se wo fresh off wo Ghana so bompa ya mano. Titi mo fri Ghana ba bedru America kuremo o woni woni ayi abijan woni Lagos <laughs> woni Dubai wonya big chance pa big opportunity ke sie sie ya adwuma wo ho abetimi anya sika wo betimi ayi adwuma no anya sika no wo afre so for so for for mom pa ye ma e ma wo ka yeah well enti sa mindset we pa na ye nua no market ano Brother, it's so sad. Now you are who some say I was here. You buy a house up and you who say yeah, yeah. We're powerful. Yeah, you need to need to do ano. I am so powerful, but we don't realize that yeah, yeah. Casa, yeah, yeah. Powerful. That's right. Fabi, come home, brother. Now, yeah, my home too. And Italy. Okay, we that's it. Yeah, Casa, yeah, che. And um, uh, who say? And no ma me a new semiensa and uh a delicate pass over can wasem. Na one can was him so I do no eda if you ask. You know, we have to miss the English and the chi. Um so I don't know whether I have to speak chi or I have to speak English. So you can speak English. Okay. So um our people are in mainly majority of our people our minds are in in prison in cage our minds have been enslaved and then um, you see our contact with the europeans change our course as a people for good and for bad and much of it is is bad so we we started to define ourselves by the the settings the institutions that they put in place and in the workers i don't say uh yeah you're very negative um i know a lot of our learned people seem not to agree with this and then they look for solutions and they always come to a conclusion that there is something wrong with us I can say that there's nothing wrong with us as a people originally no much of it is systemic much of it is conditioning 
much of the way we behave is environmental. The things that we've been told, the things that we've been taught, the things that somebody has shown us. And he said, Oh, share your call for what you have now or bomb pies or so for be one man. I it is the kind of for us the religion that we have seen, and especially the European Christian religion. And it's very delicate for anybody to talk about it. If you say anything, the first thing they will say is that you are against oh, yeah, that one, Sam. yes, you are mm -hmm. the devil. You are before mm -hmm. you are against God, yeah. You understand spiritual things, mm -hmm. you know. I'll tell you that <laughs> if the Europeans who came to this same religion were able to sell human beings for centuries hmm. and they took them to the other side, and the treatment they gave them was so dangerous, later disastrous, and they continue to do that then I want to know their understanding of what we call Christianity. Because mm. much of our understanding now is coming from what they explain to us. You know, the way we understand Christianity. Much mm. of it is coming from the way the Europeans... Yes, yes, yes. To us. And they, we, have, we know that they never explain anything to lift us up. No. Make us a great people. They explain things to make us enslaved and colonized to put us in, in bondage. Yeah. A lot of the things that we express now, we express them out of that foundation, out of that understanding. You know? So, so they use fear to explain the gospel. They use fear. You know? So fear of demon, fear of the devil, Fear of not going to heaven, fear of uh, being killed, fear of poverty, fear, fear of uh, you know diseases, fear of people. So our gospel mainly was you know was explained to us. The the, the, the first principles were out of fear. You know, it's, it's not a gospel of liberty, and it's still going on now. So people believe that there is a spirit somewhere that is going to, you know, that is responsible for their success. And there's some demon somewhere that is responsible for their, defeat, for their defeat and their difficulties in life. A lot of it is not true. In this life, the knowledge you have, the understanding you have, the wisdom you have, the mind you have, the quality of thought you have, the exposure, the skill set, those things, decide what you become. It's not the devil. If that were the case, then where was God when the Europeans were killing human beings? Ah, ah. human beings? Where is God today in, in Russia? Somebody is bombing Ukraine, killing lives, children, pregnant women, sick people, elderly people. Where is God? If God is responsible for that, you know, so when somebody picks anything to destroy you and you cannot build a counter and you can't fight back you cannot wait for god and pray for no god. they will kill you and get away with it so a lot of our understanding is that leave everything to god it was from the european understanding of i mean the things that they taught us they will put chain on the hands and legs of your men they will, they will rape your woman and show you that pray to god for liberty is the same thing that we have now. And so our understanding of God is God will come and liberate us from our difficulties. We just have to pray to him. <laughs> and I and I say that that is the gospel you explain to people you don't want to be great. It's the religion. And religion is a powerful tool. It can lift people and it can destroy people. And they knew it. And so they use it for our destruction. And it's so evident now. You know, it's so ev evident now. And, and, and Africa, especially West Africans, uh, much of the things that we practice, the big men who preach and open the Bible, I can tell you, these fundamentals, we deny them. Now, we brother, have not taking time to study this. Brother. Yes, mother. These fundamentals were denied to 
a woka no me mm -hmm. yeah matena sori mo me kona me kwa sori ya for me life nyina yeah na adia ba ko a me di hunu pa se se woda sori mo a you are in the bondage ne se church church na wo mo no e putu fie in you so much yeah yeah church Mm. Church put to her a free time. Me decided say, me and Casano, I would think, and I'm starting to me watch it as uh, me listen to some podcasts, and 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 I mean I did my own research and listen to people and me say many be so much to the stand say, time and I'm a war sorry mono. Now I am so fearful say even crowd back and watch it. That's right. Who bet me a nipa? One cassa bet me a cassa. No, 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 no. I dear wedi and yard ya. We have been quite soft on a cassa and cry. Who bet me a more near Bahos no cassa? Oh, no, I saw a canyon no correct. Who's not say? Who's not so crow can who moon a pier for no crab, I said, and yano crow free sense no so so be a way chida, a barbe, a bar, a bar tackle. That is nothing. Oh, Brunin in a chair, sir. Bible and A lot of Ghanaians, Minuano Ma, Womuo Krum has a brother, bondage, Moody and Yamia Yomunin asked, Womuda Hot bondage. When it comes to church, I fundamentals, sir. Say fundamentals are wrong one. When the foundations are wrong, <laughs> nothing else can be done until the foundation is corrected. So say, uh, if the beginning is wrong, if the first principles are wrong, everything else that stems from it will be wrong. If the first fruit is wrong, it's scriptural. Everything else, then the lamps will be wrong. You know, you can put a new wine in an old wine skin. That's what Jesus said. You know, so if you want, you have to put it in a new wine skin. You put new wine in new wine skin. If you put it in the old wine skin, <laughs> it will destroy. It will not be a good wine for you. So the fundamentals are wrong. And if the fundamentals are wrong, it's like um, you never you never knew how to, let's say, nobody ever taught you. No matter how many years you are, you will still not know it. So the age will not solve it. The age will not solve, not solve it. it. Even having, you know, so many people following you, as we see a lot of churches with members, does not mean that they have the fundamentals understood. Having our colleagues, doctor, PhD, no, the thing that will show that they understand is the truth they teach, is the liberty they bring to the people. Is the freedom they bring to the people? Is the love that emanates from what they teach? Is the unity? Is the bond? Is is the is the bond? The togetherness, the one mind, the well being, the understanding, the fulfillment that the preachings bring. You know, and you and I know that the people. One of the things that you can see that people have been uh, have been put in prison is fear. Fear. And a lot of our people. There's no love. It's fear. No, no oh, love. Fear. 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 The kind of gospel, the Bible, are not the one that the European created, because the Europeans created the gospel, a church, and put Jesus there and made him white and made the devil black, and that yeah. is the kind of gospel that yeah. we practice. So everything yeah. godly is attributed to the European. Yes. Everything devilish yes. is attributed yeah. to the African. And so the no, African. Brother, means so much, that alone, yes. that alone, Christ should let us wake up. That's that yeah, alone. But, yeah. Yeah, but our people, 
once you put a people, but you see, there's something. There's yesterday I was saying that the battlefield is the mind. You want to liberate any people, you bring light, illumination to their minds. And that's why there is no greater weapon than the minds of the people. You can put somebody in jail, but if his mind put somebody outside jail, if his mind is in bondage, he's in prison. So the greatest tool that you have to use to liberate any people is the minds of the people. And how do you liberate the people? By bringing knowledge, understanding, wisdom that will make them feel con in control and responsible for their lives. So God, his major principle is that as a man thinks in his heart, so he is. That is basic. The way you think is the way you are. You are responsible for whatever happens in your life. You know, and you, you are the creator of your life. It's not God. So they That's told us that God will solve, oh, brother. God will solve every problem. Can it's you say God. it again? Can you are the creator you of your again? life. It's not God. Yes, not God. It's not, it's not somebody putting oil on your head or give it, praying for you. This, these are basic because the same people praying for you, you know, they are, they are riding big. They are living big. Their children go to the best schools. The same problem that you have, they have them. Who do they also go to? You know, so the two, the basic two is that you, God gave you will. You are responsible. If God is going to judge me, and if God is going to judge you, then why would another man be responsible for my life? Uh -huh. And I will be held accountable for that life. So God gave us will. You use it to create your life. But most of these guys are just after money. They don't see anything anywhere. They say that spiritual problems, I can tell you in this life, what, what is spiritual problem? Even if you come to Christianity, if you so believe in Christ, as they say, if you believe in Christ, as they say, there's freedom. If you, if you believe in Christ, he's lifted you from darkness into light, as they say. So where is the power of demon well, yes. to keep you in bondage? I, I, no question. So if, no, no. You, if you really understand the gospel, this yeah, thing uh -huh. don't happen. Uh -huh. And so uh -huh. it's deception. It, it is deceptional or deceptive for anybody to use those things to control you and continue to extort money from our people. So you dream now. Somebody must interpret that dream for you. Your child has to go to school. Some prophet must. A lot of these guys. If you look at the results we have now, much of what they are telling us, they are all deceptional. They are all deceptive. They are all deceptions. And you can see that. And this kind of gospel is coming from. You know, the, the Americans created it. They added healing, prosperity. Aye, they to make it, mm -hmm. And they entered into Nigeria. Aye. And it spread everywhere. And so you see that the Africans don't have right understanding of life. Everything is prayer and spiritual. And Everything is prayer and spiritual. That brother, I am a home to crack and see and say, Who free bomb pie? Who free bomb pie? Mini mobi. And I said, Yes, a mini mobi cry. So we'll be yare. I ni pane yare yemo ya ding. That's one for now. Call hospital. Now the next nephew saw a bomb pile. Man, obewu. That's it. Obewu. Obewu. Yeah. And you know, we're up on China. We say, and look around. Me ni me say say ma kudum pen pen subi a brother. Me I think say me me in care ni obe gune say say ya sorry. Say ya nyami ya wo sumono. Say ya mi mi nyami ya me sumono no. Mm. Me, what I understand in life when I say, so what about home modeling? A deal, you know, from an apple say you know about home modeling. Then you know do tick what on parcel. Now, can say, God, thank you, say ne, the me be a quart ne ya. And your what effort, what effort I put you in? No, what you mean to not them? Now when you weekly money, now thank you God. How can God who can work and give you the money? It is not true. He said the diligent hand shall prosper. You will prosper as your soul prospers by faith. Faith is action. So Oma the money. And now they are, you see, the, the way they have made it, it is no more about the truth. It is who is saying what it is that makes it true. And that is not true. And a lot of these guys were not taught. I'm telling you, they've been deceived. And they are all looking for the solutions now. And the best way to say it is, oh, the Africans have been cursed. God cursed the, the, the black man. We are inferior. The white man is most intelligent. We are corrupt. We have bad leadership. A lot of it is not true. 
a lot of what they tell us is not true. A lot of our, our, our freedom will come from the right understanding of religion because most of us are religious. And so if they can change the religion, then they can change your destiny. Religion when, is killing us all. When the white man came to Africa, there were traditional priests who were honest, loving, kind. They vilified them. They demonized them. Even if they were truthful, good people, they, they told us that everything that we practiced was wrong. And everything they practiced was right. And so right. now you can see somebody who is a crook, wicked man, who is destroying lives. But this, so long as he says that I'm a pastor, yeah. uh, people will defend him. Yeah. But you can see somebody who is honest, truthful, kind, compassionate. So long as he says that I'm a traditional priest, yeah. there are people who say you are of the devil. Yeah. That is how conflicting yeah. our understanding is. Yeah. And That's what they tell us. You see, look at the look at Judaism. Is is it different from what our, our grandfathers practice? Because in the Bible, Judaism is not Christianity. That's why Paul had to convert to Christianity. He could not be Christian by being Jewish as, as, as practice. You know, adhering to the, to, the, to, the, to the Jewish practice. No, you had to accept Christ. So those who have not accepted Christ then are not Christians, isn't it? So yeah. between them and our tra the so-called traditional, there's no difference. But our people will go to Israel and, and go and wail against the wall. I, they say that I, it is what? <laughs> they I, are serving Christ. But then when they go to their village, they say that it's fetish. Because when I, the white man preach something, you see, so there is racism. It becomes the truth. The truth. And it it's not the truth. truth. Right. God's word. So a lot of our people, that's why they wear suit to preach. That's why they wear tie. And you'll never see them in Kentucky cloth to preach. Because the design was European. The design was European domination. It had nothing to do with Christ and his love and his principles. And so we have to find that line again. Or we will continue to be in bondage. You know, And that's what is where the, the trouble is. And, and thank God, many people are finding this. They are yes. trying to see that yes. you can preach me your faith. But don't, don't, don't tell me that my culture is evil. And your culture is the standard. In that case, you didn't come with Christ. You came with a different agenda to dominate me and to make me a, a, a servant, to make me a slave. And that's what is happening. Mm. <laughs> Anna sorry was so na any papruzin for that form one e wa form one o mu ko o mu fisis ni adi no mu dem ni e kekan hu ni nyina no se sa history na da ho no na eni pa ko university e wi eni pa ni ma die e kita bible enim sa history we ni na na ni pa ntimi ma ye ni ma e ho starting think se ah i didn't na me me ti mi kuro na wo watumi aba me me kuro na odi wo buku abre me would you book the bram? What's up, a family? What shall we am I a kayakadia? Would a near match as a wokai, mimi, what me religion that that? What about the kumi me religion? Would the wadi abrami? Just a brother, what my money book was able to call a midimadi abramo, monye, namo de amo, so or donia, when you would buy an old bet, name, name, buy or buy any answer, but twist to what train one more was so crass, and you've been quite a do so. Na uh, professors, doctors, whatever, whatever, you know, a disabled creature. Actually, say, media, brother, me can say, no, it's be, it, they have brainwashed us for centuries. Ah. And you can brainwash people. That's why you can see somebody, uh, a religious leader will bath and they will go for the water uh, and drink it. Yeah. That's why somebody will say that I'm a prophet and he can sleep with all these girls that uh, follow him. And they will not question anything. It's brainwashing. You can you can actually tune, program human beings to do what you want, and that's what they did, and they did it systematically. Oh, and they, they had did to it go. Well. They had to go after our culture, our religious beliefs, 
And the professor that you're talking of is being brainwashed. He doesn't know it. A lot of our professors have conflicting understanding of who they are because much of the content in our books are European superiority. The things that they teach us, they will not teach you farming based on what your grandfather knew. They will teach you farming based on what they knew. They will not teach you medicine based on what your grandfather knew. They will teach you medicine based on what they knew. They will teach you mathematics based on European. So it's not really an African education that they are giving us. They're giving us an education that will always look up to the white man as the savior. And so they've been brainwashed. All of us, we went through the same structure. We've been brutally destroyed. And so we cannot fight for our own. We can't stand up. If you see an African who is free, there's an African who has studied something that is not taught by the same system. He studied something beyond the lies of the Europeans, you know? And that is the free African. If an African is not exposed to that kind of knowledge, you see, you see him in suit and tie, speaks English, they will say that he went to Yale, Harvard, uh, yeah. educated. It's not yeah. true. No yeah. matter the institution that an African has gone to, it's still not educated. Because education starts with the, with the, with the knowledge of your, of your history. So if they go to teach you the history of Europeans, you are not educated. You are not. No. Are not. And so you can meet the, some of them. They went to Cambridge, all these kind of great institutions, European. But if they're Africans, when they come, they can't change anything. Because they don't understand the culture, they don't understand their history, they don't understand themselves. And so they are weak people. If you want to overcome any people, change their history. Because it's like a tree. You don't expect a tree to be strong without strong roots. And it's your, your sense of history is your root, is your foundation. If it's weak, any wind can blow you. And many of our professors, politicians, preachers, holders of big institutions are in conflict because that kind of knowledge was not taught them. Have you ever gone to Anglican church or Roman Catholic church or Methodist church? Look at how they still have their service. It's European. It's Western. It has nothing to do with Africa. You know? And they, when they were even going to school, they told them not to speak their language. They will punish you. That's how much they have destroyed us. And so yes, the effect. I, I, I saw it. <laughs> so the effect that we see now, where a young girl does not want to stay here, he wants to go to America, where a young man would want to go through the desert to get to Europe. And he believes that once he gets to Europe, Europe he, he will become successful. There's no brainwashing more than this. Where you have doctors who say that I don't care how I get to England. I want to move out of Nigeria. I want to move out of Ghana because our politicians are corrupt. I see the European politicians are angels, you know, so because quality information says of what they can use to build themselves have been hidden from them. And uh, we all went through that. <laughs> Do you know how many years that America here, they want to transform mm -hmm. the buying gun, if somebody mm -hmm. wants to buy the gun, yeah. background check. That's right. Because and they cannot do it because they cannot mm. get a vote to do it. Mm -hmm. Because the politicians, the Republicans, and some of mm. the Democrats, you know, mm -hmm. they lobby and mm. they, 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 they will call it corruption. Uh, corruption. A politician yeah. is collecting brand yeah. or whatever. Yeah. Woman, right. woman, woman, yeah. woman, yeah. Woman, yeah. Woman, yeah. Woman, so nice, <laughs> so <lobby>. beautiful. <laughs> Say lobby. They yeah. lobby. They yes. not yes. campaign. So it's, it's your, but you see, they train us to say that you, anything you do, you have to, it has to be called corrupt or corruption. You, your standard is low. That's the yeah. African, that's the task. Yeah. And it's not today that they use that. It was an agenda they use right from the day they came here. It was a scheme. The Africans are poor. It's a word that there's no reason that they are using it. No. The Africans are corrupt. It's not now that they've been using yeah. it for the last 100 years. Yeah, yeah. Africans oh, are yeah. not intelligent. Yeah. Africans are this. It's yeah. worse that they've been using. They, yeah. We didn't even behave like that. Yeah. But we use that. They had to tell us those for us to accept. And then they had to say that they were in charge. 
they were correct. They were honest. And there are top Europeans who still believe this. They had, they had huge institutions. They believe that the African is corrupt. And so they are critical, situ critical positions that they will never give to African. Uh -huh. yeah. They are told that see these people as corrupt and see themselves as the only intelligent people. It's, it's something that they use. And they, a lot of them still believe it anyway. A lot of them still believe it. And a lot of Africans still believe these inferior descriptions that they have used on us. So, and also, um, sorry, if you go to church every Sunday in Ghana, mm. and this preacher or your pastor keep on prospering, prospering, they be a water careful for water. Hey, just a mean, just your back who says, I mean, so who suffer, I mean, no, sorry, they may be any additional correction, your man are this prosper. Not the Biamima Basson, my better correction, your man are this prosper. Because now they are just on the moon, you know. No, they can't see it because brainwashing works. Jesus says something. He says that if the one who leads you is blind, everyone goes into the <laughs> everyone and who follows you. Blind him. man, yes. I blind my way. The war, yeah, yeah, papa, papa. Yeah, papa. and, 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 and yeah. because if you are not blind, why are you the one prospering, the only one, and everyone else is getting poor? And you continue to take ten percent from them to say that if you don't yeah. bring time, you don't yeah. go to heaven. Yeah. And in Ghana now, in Nigeria now, the only job they want to do is to start a church. Aye. I mean, I said, ten percent. Who knew me? Me ten percent. They say my poor be. Ah, me ten ten percent. They support to no Ghana. So I'm ten percent, and I'm a quarter. So then I'm a demand. They say me they support to be Ghana. I support it. I support. That's what I do. Why do I have to come and give my money, money to the church? I don't want. I don't even want them to use my money to pay the church auditorium. So you know, use that money to support somebody in Ghana. No, they won't do that because the person started the church and registered it in his name. So it's no more ghost church as they want to tell us. It's it's their business, and it's the is is the best of business because nobody chases you for anything. Nobody. Nobody. You continue to collect money. If you feel and, question and, too much, Kurana. So I saw him Kurana question too much, Kurana. So I saw any group, any bar, most of one Abe Jaya saw him. And never forget that that the Europeans use the same thing. The Catholic Church was responsible for whatever happened in terms of slavery and colonization. The Catholic Church led it. You know, so there's so much that our people must search if you are looking for freedom. See, a freedom part there. A lot of what we know, I can guarantee you, 99% of the things that we know, we have to question every one of them. Everyone, because it's so it's so clear that things are not right. And somebody will say that oh, the African is bombarded is not true. It's the conditioning, it's the errors that they have taught us, and we continue to believe them. And to say, I no man, sorry, every Sunday now uh be for two hours. And the you know, they tell you that they are teaching you something about the spiritual. Oh, it's, it's nothing spiritual. If there is no truth, love, kindness in those, there is nothing spiritual about it. You know? And you can see it. These are people who just elevating themselves and putting down the rest of the people and taking advantage of them. Or Joe Passport also come on and say, be your visa. What for? What for? If somebody wants visa, just go to the embassy. If you want business to grow, go and learn how to run a business. Why should somebody who has never done this tell you that because I follow God, I have power to pray that and everything will change. And you have followed them for 20 years. Nothing has changed. Because that's not how anything is built. It, that's anything not how things is, work. No. Anything is built with right understanding of how things are built. You want money? There's a way. There are things that you have to know about money. You want a successful home? There are things that you must know and practice. You want to build a country? There are things that you must know and practice. No matter how many years you pray, it won't change. Oh, you must know how to sow. You must have the sewing machine. You must be willing to sew before you can get the cloth out of that whatever you want to sew out of that cloth. You know, so they they have confused a lot our people. They know nothing about building anything, but they still believe that God will just supernaturally do it for them. And also, brother, this is so sad. Also, is that the women today? I said mm. I come. I, I'm, I'm coming after the women. We mm. eat whatever we want to eat. Mm. We gain the weight. We get yeah. the hard blood pressure, and we are yeah. praying for God. 
to to heal us. Yes, yeah. Because somebody told you that oh 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 mama ubenya hoto. Ubenya hoto. So you see, a lot of our women are bleaching. They are taking all kind of medicine to get you know weight. Or kwa juma mwa oni di on 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 ni di yo. They just eat anything. They're wearing all these weaves. They cover this 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 hair is not reacting with the sun. No. We cover everything, and we say that we are not healthy. How would you be healthy? You know, you have changed the melanin. You have you have you have, you have ripped it off. You are taking all kind of things so that you become fair. You eat all kind of food, and then and when then you get you cancer, to church to pray, and you get you get cancer, you say that is the devil is not. You the devil. The devil. It's, your it's your lifestyle. It's your ignorance. It's the things that you eat, the things that you don't eat, the things that you drink, the things that you don't drink. That's why you have diabetes. It's not the devil. And we must, I'm an engineer. If I have an engine, if you want the engine to work well, there are things that you do. They give you procedures. This time, change the oil. If you don't change the oil, the engine will break down. The human being is a system like that. If you understand how the human structure works, it can live for whatever years that you want it to live. You know, but they want us to believe that you can just do whatever you want to do. And then go and pray. And go and pray and everything will be all right. That is deception. That is lie. And that is... This doesn't gospel. work like that. No. It's not true. Somebody will tell you that once you bring your tight, go to sleep, everything else will work for you. That's a lie. That's a lie. So just see. deceiving people. So yeah, and they have deceived... Yes. They have, de they have deceived our people so much that when they even see... The, when you say the truth now, you are a liar. You are a liar. You are a devil. So much to watch. Yeah. And they have no confidence in themselves anymore, in their own abilities. No, God will do everything for you. <laughs> Where is God? There is a war in Ukraine now. Where is God? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Nigerians are, are praying. Ghanaians are praying for the war to stop. You sure? No. If you want to stop it, go and fight the guy. He will stop. Go and negotiate with him. It's not prayer. We don't get so it. We are waiting for God to de develop our continent. It will never happen. God is not God can, will not pick uh, the pickers to come and construct the road for you. God will not clean your gutter for you. No. God will not build the schools no. for you. No, it's not God. It's you. Why would you create a human being and give them brains and then you don't want them to use the brains? Mm -hmm. And you want to God is not that stupid. But they want us to believe that that is God. So somebody will and sell you apple. And that's what we believe in. That's what yeah. we believe. Somebody will sell you apple so that when you eat that apple, everything will change in your life. That's a lie. I... Somebody will sell you water. Somebody will sell you oil. Somebody will sell you all kind of things. So people have no real, uh, no, no, no taste, you know, no hunger for knowledge to transform their lives. No. For responsibility. Yeah. For organization. We yeah. don't have that. Everything yeah. is God. And from the list of the preachers to the top, this is what they have taught us. All of them. None is exceptional. Not the ones I know. All of them. It's all deception that they are teaching our people. And we cannot wake up to say that this one is not true. We don't put our humans, the lives of our people, as the most important thing. No. We don't. We put everything else, but not the lives of our people. So even politicians, they don't put the lives of our people as the most important thing. They put themselves and their family, and the money they will get as the most important thing. That's why they go for the office. The same with the preachers. It's not the lives of the people. That's why the poverty, the crime, the pain of the masses don't get their attention. They will tell you that Jesus said that the poor you have with you all the time. But did Jesus ever say that you drive Land Cruiser out of the collection ah. of the people? You know, so the, until the people uh, uh, wake up, the people wake they, will up. Continue. they will continue to do this to us. And you will see professors, engineers, doctors, lawyers sitting under them and being taught this. Oh, day. oh, or be our true Bible. They uh, chew the Bible, Baba, into their head, mm -hmm. and professors and doctors are sitting underneath mm -hmm. them. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm catch them in your bar. I'm going to be a baby video. I'm going catch it on a say. Hey, Bob Brown, I'm going to be a baby. I'm going to be a baby. I'm going to be a baby. Critical thinking. There was so and, uh, that's right. That element is is disabled. Critical thinking, questioning, reasoning, they are disabled in our in in our world. And you know, Christianity does that to us. Oh, do you know mm -hmm. that if you start thinking outside the box, then now you become a devil. Oh. Yeah. 
What am I saying? But without yes, I agree. But without you thinking, what else can you solve? You can't solve anything in your no, life. No, but we've been like this for years, oh. We've been like this for years. Yes, <laughs> yes. Among your own siblings, the yes. So if you start thinking outside the box and seeing things yes. different now. Brother, me come and chill. Say, say, in the past ten years, a move best eight, and I said this put sexy. And to us, you, maybe. Oh my God, just a few. Never to us. Oh my God, oh my God, baby. Oh my God, baby. That's why nothing changes because the world belongs to those who are thinking. The world belongs to those who are thinking because the yeah. difference come between come here, come here, come here, the world belongs to those who are thinking. The difference between us. And the animals or animals is, is the thinking ability God gave us, the power of the mind. So the difference between the most successful and the other one, a lot of the times, many times, is the ability to think well and take right decisions. It has nothing to do with all these things that they, have to, they are telling us, you know. And so if you want to do well, we are, we are to other, stop calling prophets for answers. They don't have it. Stop looking for sticker and anointing oil and all those. They are lies. They are not true. A lot of the things that they teach, the, the, the reason God gave his word is so that you can use the word to transform your life. So if they are not teaching you the right thing, how is your life going to transform? You know, they have to give you basis. You apply them, then your life will change. It's not supernatural. Then why would Jesus sit down and teach the people? He taught them how to live. We, we just say that once I, I pray for you, your life will change. That's a lie. Hi. And that's why it's not Hi. working. You teach the people principles, steps, how you must organize your things. And then your life will change. No, it's not us. So everything is as if God is, is just magic. And look at our results. It's not true. Everything. 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 Look at our, look at our TV. Look at our TV. It's entertainment. It's sports. It's politics. It's comedy. It's about you know all kind of things. Look at young young women. When you see any African or Ghanaian especially on social media, what are they talking about? They are insulting people, talking about sex, marriage, and the other ones are opening Bible and telling us that the world is coming to an end. Okay. And the other people will tell you that God, you know, and this we are occupied, obsessed with these things. And on and the other hand, we are we are saying that how can a our country develop. But your time, these are the things that you are occupied with. Sports, entertainment, European football. That's what you are occupied with. You want to develop. The Americans and those people, they went everywhere, took advantage of others, and then oh. they used them to develop. People work for them for 300 years. You Africans now, you, nobody is going to work for you for 300 years. No. You are not going to take gun and go and take people's good and technology and culture. So you have to have different way to develop and yet the time you have you're, you're following sports look at the people we celebrate they are musicians africans not only in africa look at jamaica african-americans the only people they show us are sports people entertainers as if those are the only things that we can do so when it comes to wealth and power we are no close no they never put spotlight on people who are building things who are africans never because that is the system that's the strategy the best you can do is to entertain us. Yeah. You know? So you look, mention any African that you hear. Any Af African-American, it has to be sports. It has to be entertainment. We've got to stop that. We have to say that we have to build things, build companies, build structures, build products, because that is where the greatness is. Build weapons. Because the people who are fighting now, if you can't build weapon, they will sit on you. Those are the things that we have to tell our children. You know, the generation says, stop the comedy, stop the entertainment, because that is not where it is. You will forever be slave. You will forever be those at the bottom, because you always want to entertain. No, life is not about that. It's about building. Create a business. Create something. Start a cocoa farm. Start a processing plant. You know, if you can get a lot of our people to think like that, and if you can promote this, why should the supermarket in our area be owned by a foreigner? Oh. Why? And we are singing. And you see a lot of our musicians, they think that they have arrived. What are they singing about? Women waste and everything else. <laughs> they sing, they, the, songs that they, the songs that they, they, they are not even inspiring. They don't wake the people up. We just drink and go and dance and go and sleep.
tomorrow will come. So that's why you be poor. And part of it is the brainwashing. Part of it is the brainwashing. So it's a, it's a serious thing. And the only way we can get our people out is to let them have the information. Because somebody got them to this level. We have the responsibility to tell them that this is not the way. We are lost. We are lost. It's not just preaching go to heaven. It's not entertainment, Beyonce and Sarko, uh, Shatawali, Black Stars, and Sports. Where are you going to go with this? When many of your people, graduates coming out, 300,000 people are coming out every year from our higher institutions. Where are they going to get the jobs? These are the critical things because this is life and death for them. Our, our young people should not finish school and have the belief that they cannot be successful here. No, we have to tell them that the, the greatest place to become successful is here. It's just because their minds have been captured. So they don't know, they, they can't even listen. The moment they start to listen, they will see all the opportunities here. There's no place that has more opportunities than the continent. The only problem is that our people are blind and they've been taught to be blind. And it was systemic, it was structural. We have to come out of that system, that matrix. We train ourselves, we read history, we read technology, we read business, we read finance. We're not following entertainment. We're not following religion to the core as if nothing else is important. You know, so there's, there's, there's a fight and we are in a war. It's more dangerous than what Putin is doing. You know, we've been in war for the last 500 years or so. We're just not aware that we are in war. Yes, we are. Yes, we are, <laughs> brother. Yes, we are. And imagine that if I have a son. Yes. My son. Yes. I don't have this kind of thinking. Yeah. And my thinking is about fearful and, mm -hmm. um, I mean, it's all about church and it's all yeah. about what devil can do to you. It's yeah. Not from me, you know, then I'll give it to my children. Yeah, that's and right. my yeah. you give it to Generation and generation. And yeah. So like you said, it's been like this for so many, so many years. years. Yeah. And even now that can go to social media, that yeah. we are, things people are speaking up and we are, waking up we are waking up and i think little by little we are going to wake up and see right. that being a religious mm. going to church and tangle yourself with church you know mm -hmm. it doesn't mean nothing if mm -hmm. africa if church and christianity make people success africa ghana west africa should be the number one successful country in the whole world Absolutely. west africa that's right and it's not true and it's not what true are, what you are pra practicing is another form of christianity it's not the real one it's not the real one it's just people becoming uh, uh, celebrities it's not the real one it's not jesus said something said that there were two people somebody was was beaten and on the road there was a preacher who saw him but he didn't take care of that man and then there was another man who was not a preacher, took care of that man and sent him to a uh, hospital. He said that that man did the work of God. But in a, in a today, he's the one who is carrying the Bible, who is doing the work of God. He's not the one who is helping people. Yet the master did not say it like that. No. No. So we have wrong understanding. And it's because the one who introduced this kind of Christianity to us did, they have, did not have value for human life. So they did not. Problems, and they still don't have value for human life. If you say that you want Africa to develop, World Bank, IMF, and all these people, oh. how much do we need to develop? It's not just technology and trillions that you have been using to go to war. That's if you a really, if That's you, a if you really mean that you want Africa to develop, if you want Ghana to do well, just give them $500 billion. Give them technology. Help them to set up industries. If they will not develop, it's a lie. It's a lie, you know? So it's the, the deception was before it. And the white man was at the top of it. Yeah. And he has always wanted power and word for yeah. himself. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it's working because yeah. devil is black and Jesus is white. It's yeah. working. It's and working. professors and lawyers and judges yeah. and everybody goes to all of us in bondage. Yeah. So the it's professor will wear, will wear wig. Wig, aye. And go and lie. Aye. And that has only, only 
chicken and you want and to put him in jail for 12 years for 12 years politician who stole money nothing is done to him because the law respects those with fame power yeah not yeah. The truth. but if you sent that case to the chief <laughs> no crabber daddy no crabber daddy so the system was designed it's a jacket on us democracy is a jacket that is not helping us the the legal structure is a jacket that is not helping us even education as we have it is not helping us you know the financial structure is a system that is not helping us so if you want to do well as an african you've got to study all these systems or you'll be a slave all your life you'll be a slave the whole you know so if you educate the african you know he does not know that he's a slave so he's become a doctor he works for some five thousand a month ten thousand a month and half of it is is for tax and he lives in texas somewhere or california oh, and, he's he thinks it's better. He's and he thinks it's really better and yet the chinese who came here one year has millions of dollars and you if a hundred thousand dollars you don't have and you still think you're better think again think again because you it, there's a system that has been put on your head so you you see that car that you have that is on loan that house that you have that is on loan that education that you had that you have two hundred thousand to pay to pay he didn't need that because you can't have freedom with that finance being right so if you don't go to that chair that job you have no freedom that no matter what education they gave you they just fed you fat so that they could kill you and that's what they have done you know so we have lawyers engineers doctors africans they just work all their lives when they get to 65 they say go on retirement you have, still have life to live and you, have, you don't know what to do with your life because the most important things that they should have taught you was that there are ta there's talent you have there's a reason you were born find that it's not just the profession that they gave you and steady money because the, those who control well the world steady money, money. believe steady in money. wealth creation and don't just live for yourself live for the next generation what are you leaving them I just live in them. My father was a doctor. My father was an engineer. What are you living them? Are you living them some properties, some business? Are you, don't say that, oh, I, I just need a little to live and have a good life. No, it's not about you. It's about the next generation. Yeah. Now, that information, they will not put it in school for you. They will say that once you become a lawyer, just get some, you know, some court and just do something and we pay you 120000 a year. You know, you are doing fine. You have a nice car. You come to Ghana, you spend two weeks, you go back, you think uh, you're successful. You're not I, successful. I, you are not successful. The Chinese I, are repatriating a lot of money from Ghana to, to their country. The Indians are doing the same thing. Where yeah. are you? Yeah. Where are you? This is the yeah. wealth. You come yeah. to build your country so that you can live a better country. If Kwame Nkrumah had said that I didn't have to go to Ghana, I just had to stay somewhere, enjoy my life. We will not have freedom. If JB Danko had said the same thing and decided to live in England, we will not be where we are. You know, Akwanje and all those uh, men. If 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 Yasantwa did not fight back, if Prempe and all those guys did not fight back, we will not be where we are. So what are you fighting for? So that the next generation can have a better life. You know, it's not about us. It is so so it does not matter who does not agree. We should not be afraid. <laughs> Brother, what if I can say I think I best see me to say what the way we uh we come to we we are we are in um abroad mm. America whatever and then mm. we said oh I am scared to go to Ghana and Ghana this oh what if I said some people are waiting mm -hmm. for this is how negative we are and it, it works in all area of our life. Mm -hmm. People who are here, no, Ghanaians, mm -hmm. no, they are waiting mm -hmm. to hear bad news. And as I say, to me, mm -hmm. they are waiting. They yeah. are waiting to hear that. Yeah. Number two, maybe some of say, I don't think black Americans, we are citizens, we can take a card. Black Americans say to me, "Kwa Ghana, mu mu ni kwa kwa mu din kakran 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 kakran." So I want to say, "Now what Timmy is establishing? Now what Kwa Nim? So you make it to have no other person who could come on. Maybe I will back. No, I can't. No. What do you? Who on Krata? Who be be? What you want ni eti kroom? What you want ni kura? Kwa ne kura kwa try be be. Kwa ne kwa say di na be Timmy ya ye because the kebi ya be kwa system ni mono. I stay there to support the country. Yeah, I right. just want to and I will go to India. I will go to free Lebanese, and I will go to free Indian. Now Ghana need to be. 
Ewa gano. Unto. Unko gano ni mho. Wo se si kana anu wade kwa Lebanon. Yeah. Wo se si kana anu wade kwa India. The programmers. It's a program. Wo enti ni nipa tuntum diye. E ya na e ya wre ho se mse. I think say ye ni ya kasa ya juni mono. E na diye sa to su miyem kwa ye se adie biya ha wo mo se adie biya ye gane. Gana medi biya anu enye papa sa program ene su su no. Enu su da ya ya juni. Me to amu bag. Me bo. Me to amu bag. Me ma obi mo se pe bre me. Me to amu bag from Ghana. E na me hun bag di su su wo. Na me hwe YouTube se ya e na. Obi mo ya advert. Na ya me fe. E na bo ono. Eye fe momo di ano wa mo di free gana ba yu ne shipment ni yina akura ano na ebu ni nu sedi ya meto di ewe no meto ni sende free chana neba na ba yu no me di se me hu be be me use the be four or five times na e hu no e yina wa hu na start se a wuro mo mo ba yu me to ya no me wia waso tu ya me kabi kwa si me advert. Okay. I bought your bag and I'm still using that bag without nothing happening to that bag. But mm. the bag that I bought from online, China, mm. I didn't even know that was coming from China. You we see? rather spend our money on Chinese product. Yeah. That's yep. spend, spending on Ghana. When, like. Yeah. Meanwhile, the auto, yeah, the yes, no. I don't make okay. it. That's what I'm saying. Okay. So it's part of the program. You see, our meeting with the Europeans changed everything. And they built a lot of things, ideologies, structures, systems, to have us to think the way we think now. And to have us continue to think this way. And now, it's not they will not even have to fight. It's the systems that they set in place. Yes, it's, our people that they have, yeah. it's our people that they have educated. They will fight for. Yeah, them. yeah. These are people who have lived with them. Now they yeah. behave more white than the white man himself. You know, so they have forgotten who they are. They have lost their identity, and so they don't fight for their own people. You know, so it's it's it, it, it's a it's something that we I've had a lot of young boys who go to my channel, and then they will call you to say that uh, let's say I didn't want to go to Ghana, but after watching you or videos, few of them. I've decided to do something in Ghana. I've seen young men who are listening to us on radio and say that I didn't want to stay here. But after listening to you, I want to do something. I think I can do something. It's a problem of, of exposure to the light. Knowledge is light. It, it, it breaks something in your mind. It breaks something in your spirit. And that's why when anybody wants to control you, they change that through what you see, what you read. And what do so you think? If you want to do that, if you want to undo that, they say you bring a higher knowledge. And so a lot of our people, if they will, if, if they will allow themselves and they will say that, no, let me go and read again. Because it's not right for you to hate your own people, to hate your own country, and not to promote your own and to be not negative to promote towards, your own. and to be negative towards your own is 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 a not is totally unacceptable. <laughs> Ayo kurum. Yesi awo si. Yesi awo si. Se ayi fwa ya yesi yesi amkwa. Baby abe kwa ya Ghana. That's that's the only place that you can be accepted. You know, at least where you do you you. No, they say Ukraine. Well, if you are if you are from Ukraine and you move now, you are a refugee. You are a refugee. That's it. So the only place, and yet that place, you would you top anti ASM, and that's what we have to work on. That every country has troubles. But the citizens still talk to promote themselves. Yeah. We have troubles as well. And we can only promote ourselves. Let's focus on the negative. Of course. And, on the the yeah. Yeah. and let's, let's, let's reduce the negative. You have talked about all the negatives. What have you done about them? What have you done about it? At you, least no. say something positive. At least. Yes. And you continue to promote and say you are not trustworthy. Not. No. You think that the Europeans are trustworthy. Oh, you yesterday, <laughs> yesterday we were saying that, oh, when you send money to Ghana and somebody yeah. chop it a little bit, you said, uh, because somebody chop your money, you are not, listen, brother, if somebody chop your money, you know, yeah. you, you, you keep on saying that we're doing, 
um job and we we are getting loans to buy kind mm -hmm. so if i get this money as a loan somebody chop it uh, brother and yes. you are telling me say oh tilly uh, you guys are always complaining about somebody chopping your money if they chop my money and we talk about chopping our money uh, we don't have to agree with that but let us say it yes, yes chop yeah, you, yeah, you, you, somebody chop your money i didn't chop your money so don't say that again yes i'll cook that's true that is so true. That's, that's what I'm saying. That your your so brother, true. your cousin, chop your money. I didn't. <laughs> Why do you say that every Ghanaian is bad? <laughs> that is true. That is it, so true. That's no problem. And once he chop your money, that's not mean that he will. I mean, somebody else will not chop your money. Let's hear that's that one. True. Not that everybody is has so true. Your money. But if yeah. you are if you are programmed to be negative, then you promote that side all the time. And I'm a koi no movie amisika. And as I say, I'm a koto yekrano. Some of the programs that we have developed, some people have followed it and they are building their houses. Their negativities have yes. dropped. Yes. yes. Somebody called me the other time and said that, or, or sent me a message. Said, Kobna, I listened to some of the things that you said. When I was in Ghana, I followed them and they worked perfectly for me. Yeah. Before, yeah, I would be angry. I would it's go true. to some offices and fight them. And it's true. Now, when I go, I'm calm and I'm yeah. enjoying the beauty. Yes. Is the information. It is so true. It's it is so true. I'm building a house. The, the models that you're using, the way you talk to the boys, the way you engage them, you do oh, the yeah. same thing. If you're positive and you engage them, you get that house built. Yep. But if you're yep. negative and arrogant, yep. they will screw you again. And I'll yep. even tell them to screw you again. So that you <laughs> I will tell them that. Oh, your bugger, I'm going to be this guy. <laughs> oh, Mr. Midako. Yeah, thank you very, very much. Yeah. We've been here an hour and hour 15 minutes. Thank you that uh, uh, for staying awake and talking to us. We appreciate you a lot. Mm. And whenever I'm thinking about something, my critical thinking comes in, I just want to call you and then talk yeah. to you so yeah. that we can share ideas and come out here yeah. and talk you to know, our... You know, my, my parents. Both my mother and father, they live in Seattle, Washington. Uh -huh. my family lives there. You know, their wish is that you don't live in Ghana. I, tell, I told them, no, we want to live in Ghana. We are grown up. We decide where we want to live. You know, and when, sometimes when they meet their friends, they you can see that they are not happy with that. I said, no, that's not right. If I want a house and a car, yes. But if I want to build something more than that. Even now? Yeah, 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 they used to say it, you know, because Maybe that's now? where they will do, you know, I'll tell you. <laughs> that's how deeply some of this is. That's how deep it is. That's yeah. how deep it is. Yeah. And I have but friends who how live, deep it is. I have friends who live in America, classmates from tech, and uh, they don't, they always say negative things about our country. And they say that it's very difficult to live here. Uh, they even tell you, come not, not everybody is like you. Not, not everybody can take the heat. I said, well, you think everybody is like you? Everybody can live in America? No. So it works everywhere. You know, so it is deep. And they even say it as if everybody will get visa. Let's face it. Not everybody will get visa, even if, they, <laughs> if, if you want to go. So some people will have to teach them that this is how to live here and become successful. We need to do that. And I also tell them that, listen, what you see on TV is Hollywood. Hollywood so is... So true. So true. If there is anything that the West is very good at, it's branding. Project, it's yes. It's acting. Branding. If you dig, you see that you are not that bad where you are. You just have to have the right information. You know, and, and be happy to start something wherever you are. And don't hang your life waiting for visa to travel. Oh, no. oh. No. Because it's not the best. And parents should tell their children. Oh, brother. We are a baby. We are a baby. We are a baby. We are a baby. a baby. We a We a We a a a one more so that number for you to send you. Hey, it's be a good old. Maybe a hey, bondage in Avia and the understanding of form. In Tias and over form. See, I join Safi Niha. Oh, and the moment I already have a two form. No, it's a cranny book because I hang your thing across a heading. And you know, credit. And you know, credit that. 
It's far from the truth. <laughs> Very far. It's like day and night. It's like day and night. Yes. The Ghanaians, especially. What they don't know is the treasure they have. Ghanaians don't know that. Ghanaians don't know the, the treasure that they have. Africans don't know the treasure that they have. The quality of life that they have. The they don't know it. The quality of life. They don't know it. Hey. So a lot of people are just looking at Oh, the shiny, shiny thing. Oh, the shiny, shiny. Na bra, we see that crack is here. That is here. Is one of what the fabe say? A fabe would have kit was say. So we don't. Material things now. Material. Bro, oh yeah, yeah. Once the fifty, sixty. Now we we'll break it down. Now if you want October, so yeah. Why? Yeah, you finish. Oh, you're not missing something. You're not missing something. Yeah. Uh huh. Why? Yeah, Juma two, three, for twenty, thirty years. Can you be normal again? You can. No, normal. you cannot. And that's how the system is designed. They didn't change slavery. They didn't stop it. They just designed it again. Okay. You, and they you, put you, it you, you, you. Wait, wait, you know? wait. Me, 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 I said then, tell them I'm in Ghana, no? This is about 20-something years ago. Now, me rented that war, um, a typha. Now, mm. typha, now, guy, if you have to rent it by, you have to rent it by, you have well, Papa and Lana, no map, Papa and Scan will see to sell flat to the man. See, or buy, no, brother, bear my tin tin grammo, fe 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 fe, nanny half will say, I will form, and I add us half was so. And he come on, did the more another time not milk no free a year by Denmark. I know if you land in a bag and until one more barbary to them come on, barbary to them come on. And till one I got you by my. Me kuna ti a se se juma bi a woye a woye juma ne ten years a juma no ene break a a a breaking man one side kofu enti a broti ne nyabete o no bi da bi da bi da bi da nyabete the only thing we do here gan eni ba kase bi a ena mo di a mo ti a broti ne mo nyabi juma ya na mo complaining we are not complaining but the system here no you are here to work. That's right. That's all. That's it. They want to, they, to feed the system. That's all. They you need the system to work. To work. Yeah. Just work. Just work. That's it. Yeah. And one day, you say, 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 just work. Mm -hmm. And so our people must wake up and stop, you know, denigrating what they have. And no matter what I hear, Papa, no, I am too hungry. So many things are good. See, the unfortunate thing is that even the people we look up to, when they stand up to talk, they say the same thing because of the brainwash. They put us down, and then they raise America. They raise England. They raise everybody. When it comes to Africa, they continue to put us down. So when when the children or the young people hear these things what else do you want them to do to live here no because when you were talking you were raising everything you were talking every good thing about everybody else yeah but when you came to ghana yeah you use all the bad things even yeah. those who are successful here yeah those who are successful here when they are talking and you listen to them you will not want to live here no that's true you will that's not want true. to live here after listening to them you become you become depressed you know, when you when you listen to them, after listening to a lot of these people who have become even successful here, hey, you would want to go and look for visa and travel. <laughs> so a lovely okay. Africa said, yeah. I live in the U.S. and I don't want to be here. See? Very stressful. And all you do is work, 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 and no time for America fun. America was oh. built on that. Bondage, slavery, work, feed the system. Only the top one, two, three percent can be free. Everybody else is a slave to the system. Yeah. That is true. Yeah. They give uh -huh. you work, they pay you money, and then they, they give you loan. It's a system, it runs, it must run. Why do you have yeah. to give somebody loan, student loan, and you say that you can't forgive them? They have yeah, to work for their life to pay them. Now see how that me me student no yeah yeah you buy you buy them buy no yeah student loan forgiveness now oh about sixty thousand because of master's degree yeah what buy yeah no they channel in case I want to sell it as well you see look at that 
Excellent. And yet somebody is in Ghana, he completes school, he owes nothing, and he still complains that Ghana is nothing. Ghana is no good. There's no job here. You are you completed and you don't owe anybody. You can't talk about the advantages that you have. Oh. It's always the negatives. Oh. It's a program. Well, that's me. The I've devil got is black. The, 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 Jesus is what? Is white. Right. Never yeah. forget that. Those yeah. things run in everything. The African is poor. The others are rich. The African is corrupt. The others are honest. The African is weak. The others are strong. Those things, they play out everywhere. So even the Africans themselves have accepted this. So when, when they open their mouth, you can see this thing. Everything negative, they say it about themselves. And the same mouth will say all the great things about others. That it, that's a sign that the mind has been colonized. The mind has been enslaved. And majority, majority of our people, the minds are enslaved. They think like colonies. Because you don't cherish and promote our own. We always look up now, to I Now, brother, <laughs> look at what... You know, what I was sitting there one day and I was thinking about how our roads, our neighborhood are not paved and things like yeah. that. And I said mm -hmm. to myself, oh, if Ghana Road, the neighborhoods are paved, um, no, America neighborhoods are paved. You are paying, um, um, when you pay your taxes for mm -hmm. your house, you pay for mm -hmm. the paved road, you mm -hmm. pay for um, your neighborhood, Gutters, you pay for mm. a school. Uh, mm. So if neighborhoods in Ghana are paved and every house, they count the people in that house and they are collecting whatever taxes that they have to collect uh, to do it or to pay for it. Uh. Aren't we going to be like complain and things like that? Uh, we have to we will complain. Yeah. We will complain. But yeah. here, they have said it in a way that either you like it or, yeah, you can work $2,000 a week and you come home with $900, say $800. You work to feed the system. You work to, to feed the system. Uh, so but there, even hours, even hours, I think the problem is not even the taxes. The problem is the thinking. Because you have a lot of rocks, you know, that you can do pitching. Yeah. In a lot of our neighborhood. You have yeah. a lot of young men who don't have anything to do. Yeah. It's their ability yeah. to think yeah. to come up with to come up with, yeah. With solutions that are not known in other places. You devising you you're devising something that works only for you. That's our major problem. Yeah. Because we still look up to other examples. It's very difficult for our leaders to import improvise and come out with original solutions that mm -hmm. feed or uh -huh. that fit our that situation. That and is that so is true. one of the problems that we have as Africans. People devising, coming up with solutions that are yeah. original to yeah. where we are and with what yeah. we have. Yeah. You know, so if it's not being recommended by World Bank, then it's not good. Hey. If it's not America which is sanctioning it, then it is not good. Ah, come, come out with something that is original and solve your own problems. You know, so when it comes to money, I, I don't look at American examples. We do business here. If I were to start business in America, how they will grade the business, how they will value the business, go to stock market, um, investors and all that. It will be different from the part that I take here. If it comes to living in housing, housing, they give mortgages, they give money to developers. We, <laughs> the people don't have mortgage. They have to have their own money to buy or to build their own house, most of them. And the developer must have his own money to, to develop his business and develop his properties. It's a different system. We don't have the same system. Africa is a whole different system on its own. I know people must study that system and start and stop thinking as if Africa is England or Ghana is America. It's not like that. It's different. It's different things. And you have to know what fits here. You know? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. In the US, it's all about taxes too. They take a lot of taxes out. It's like you living paycheck to paycheck that's what we do yeah paycheck to paycheck i read somewhere where they said that almost 50 percent of americans don't have 400 dollars saved in their own money it's true yeah that's what they say but a lot of Ghanaians don't believe that you know because most Ghanaians, those are the bottom they, they challenge us that is the problem because we judge you see they judge us not by the top they judge us by the bottom yeah. So somebody else with degree in America will come to Ghana and compare himself with somebody who has nothing here and said, I'm better than that person. No, compare yourself with, with your co-equal. 
you know. And if you have a job in America and you come to Ghana, don't use job to grade us. Go to the provision shop owner. Go to the watch seller owner. You know, go to the, the cocoa farmer. Because that is how our economy operates. And then compare how much you make a year and compare how much they make a year. And you see that you're not that much different from them. They probably may, may be doing far more better than you. Most provision shops may be selling around thirty to 50000 a month. Ghana cities. Compare that. And don't convert it to dollar. Because yesterday the dollar was six cities. Now it's seven cities. Does that mean ah. that my house has been devalued? Ah. No. So don't compare it to that. If somebody makes 600 Ghana cities here, it's just like $600. Don't compare it. Because the life that they can live is just within that bracket. So there's a lot of things that we have confused. And so we make our people feel like they don't have anything. And it's not true. And it is Thank not you. true. Thank you. And if you think like the way uh, Mr. Obindako is thinking and the way, I'm not saying everybody should think like us, but I'm just saying with this kind of thinking, you, know, you can live anywhere and everywhere, right. especially yeah. you can live in Ghana yeah. and live your best life Yeah. because you are you don't let the system determine mm. who you are. You That's just right. do what is right mm. and follow how the system goes and then follow it little by little. You understand the whole system because you have yeah. to learn the system, understand the system, and mm -hmm. then and work your, within it. And what you doing it? Yes. So a, a lot of people do a lot of comparison, and I think those are unfortunate. Don't do comparison. Don't do. Don't say that. Oh, I was making uh, two thousand dollars in Ghana in America every month. In Ghana, making five hundred cities every month. And how much do you use for uh, to for pay your rent? Yes. If you make two thousand a month, yeah, and you don't have a roommate. To some people have two, three room. <laughs> <laughs> and somebody say that when would when would I build? A house. Don't build a house in Accra. Go to your village. Buy a land. It's thousand. And build one bedroom. It's still house. It's no mortgage. You know. So it's so different. They they they, they try to confuse everything. If you don't have money to build a house in Accra, go to Nsawam. Go to Suhum. Go to Adwajiri. The land there is cheaper. It's still house. You know. So we are complicating our lives too much, and that's Thank why we you. beat ourselves down all the time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah thank you brother i love africa us is no peace yeah you know and i went to ghana in 2000 and i didn't want to leave yeah i i am with you lovely mm -hmm. africa i am with you um, and people are here they want to leave the next minute oh they want to leave the next minute <laughs> i uh, <laughs> somebody that i know that trying to uh find a way to come here they they mm -hmm. have their own house um mm -hmm. he own a car mm. own home and mm. uh, like business and wants to live and i said why don't you visit just visit that's right oh no i want to come and get papers because of my children there's no opportunities in ghana <laughs> and i said okay i said okay i didn't argue because mm. um there's no need to try to convince anybody because if mm -hmm. before i left in ghana if i have a house i have my own car probably i am a positive person i'll be a mm -hmm. millionaire now in ghana yeah. i'm telling you because yeah. i think i can make it i'm not i think i know i can make it anywhere because you you met to me i know me right. That's right. Oh, yeah. And you know, so why do you say this is one particular place? Now, but me, yeah, yeah. Well, destiny, son, was set your mouth. And so I said to him, say, this is my bar American, my yeah, this is my code. Now, dear Crana, now, dear Crana, friend, ye dear. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, ye dear, just yes, it's a toka. And that is very far from ye dear. Ye dear is, <laughs> it's living the work that you have. If you can live your work for two years, three years. And still live the same standard of life then you are ah, ah, ah. if you have wealth if you have health if your children are happy if you have a happy family if you are contributing to society then that is success majority of our people are not in that category they can't leave the work for three months and yet they tell us that they are wealthy in america in england that's a lie that is not true hmm. so we have a lot of things that we have not thought through and we beat ourselves down. 
So somebody is, is in Sunyai, somebody is in uh, Takwa, that person has these things, but they still feel like they are nothing. Yeah. Because of their understanding. Yeah. The understanding that they have. So there's a lot of brainwashing that has, has really uh, happened to our people. I <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay. Yeah. Wow, do car crab say four hours, right? Yeah. No, I do. Me quite ye or Kumasia, met me as a mechiaba. Minu ya be what down or Kumas, also so mean me mass media on climbing me as in idiot Kumas in tea, some acquire met me a quadao, na mabba. Now me wa brooch it, now me me life in your eye, Juma. And shall bear pan a womb. Nyan samba and pane wum, nyan so obi ba chura di di me atemba te ye oki. Se, me wadan wong kran. Na me wadan wong kuma se, ne se nye sadana if it's not making money for me. I believe in having houses, because let your money work for you. You don't make your money without, no, my money have to work for me. That's why I love to buy stocks. Brother, I need my money to work for me. Na me wada won crime wo baby te kama na ma sa ko si fie o kuma se se me ko kuma se na ma kwa kwotena ho ana se me si me kra de awi na me sanya si gan wo kuma se na me ko kuma se brother to me nyan sani yeah you know yeah dey especially we yeah juma 3 4 adan ye you are dia na ho wo so na ho wo so i will not do that i will use the other one and invest that and create wealth so that if I, I don't have to go to work to eat, you know, you don't have to pick that job. At a certain stage in your life, you don't have to pick that job to eat or to live. At a certain stage, you go to work because you want to go and you can choose not to go. And majority of the people are not in that category. They must go to work even though they don't want to go. Because without that, they can't pay the mortgage, they can't pay anything, all the things that they owe. And, and for me, if you have lived for 50 years, these things should come. And it's it's a scale. It's information. They didn't teach us about money. They didn't teach us about wealth. They just taught us to go to school to become doctor, lawyer, engineer, you know, accountant, nurse, teacher. That's what they taught us. So they didn't want to create people who will be wealthy. They created people who will work to feed the system, to make a lot of the other people rich. And so that's why somebody will build a house in Accra and build a house in Kumasi and not be thinking of how do I build my own wealth. Say that if I don't how work. How do I build my own wealth? Yes. So that said that if I don't work, I can eat. And I can choose to, to work not or not work. work. No that's work. Right. Yeah. And I that's a goal. You start life, that's a goal. goal. Mm. That should be that's your goal. goal. Yeah. Say, at the age of 50, yes. 55. Yeah. I don't I want to work. I have to again. invest. I don't have to work. No. But yet, yeah, 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 programming and honey are joining in our chess set. One needs sixty something will chrome and one in retirement or call Ghana. I didn't tell I was my life belongs to me. I decide what I want to do with my life and I can project and plan towards the next five years. I don't have to wait. No, no. And so it's the same information, you know, the same information. Somebody says something, said that I return. Uh, on February 13th from Ghana, I, uh, okay, I, I am depressed and all I can think about is going back. <laughs> um, I shop at a lot at MV in Akramo. We thank you very much, Ghana Love Bag, and I also purchased two of your books. Wow, fantastic! Oh, thank, you. thank you, thank you for doing that. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> wow, and we need to. To we the women, I'm saying yeah. this because of us. We need to plan. Say mm -hmm. you don't have to retire to enjoy your life. That's you right. have your papers. You can mm -hmm. go spend yeah. four months in Ghana, yeah. five months in Ghana. If yeah. you decide to come back, you come back yeah. and enjoy right. your life until yeah. say you don't have to work yeah. anymore. anymore. Why do yeah. you have to just spend your money buy and tomorrow buy and tomorrow buy this buy this buy this we, instead of you saving that money to enjoy your life you know, just wasting your money yeah, that's right yeah, because the, 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 the,
this all being invested, whether it's in stock, whether it's in properties, whether in other businesses, bit by bit, after 10, 20 years, you have something significant invested somewhere. They said that that money gives you almost the same thing every month as your pay. You can easily leave off. You can decide not to work. And that can be done if you're intentional and you're disciplined. Everyone can do it. Everyone ah. can do it. Mete story be papa bi na no yare no nyini pa o drew tama na yare kura bono no samre na na ni koko so na samre kura na was a big project even though he was still on bed sick yeah and that is something that we can all copy mm -hmm. you know but a lot of people when they are sick all their finances are gone now this man was sick and that's when his money was even coming because he spent life to invest you know his, his resources were and the returns will come in when he was even sick and for me that is a great example and this is the kind of financial information that we have in our culture that other people don't have in our country this kind of information is here i always talk about my grandfather he was he was uh, he had his car tipper truck yeah he, he had cocoa farm he had a lot of things and he store he store uh, sand that we used to build so when he was when he was old, he was selling those things to people. People would come and buy, and that was his insurance. Mm -hmm. And he was never broke. Oh, he died. Oh, and he, and my grandfather could not read, could not write. That was my mm -hmm. mother's father. Now my father's father was educated, <laughs> and he had nothing. <laughs> I told you, didn't I tell you the same thing about my life today? Yeah, didn't I said the same thing to you too. Yes, yeah. He didn't. He he had intelligence to create wealth and he never been to school but the other guy who went to school he married a lot of girls because you know he, he could speak english <laughs> <laughs> so everybody wanted to give give him the daughter their daughter you know so the school has a way of taking a lot of the the wealth creation the financial information the the, the, the quality of life from us the because the european quality of life quality the of life. design <laughs> that school that, that, that school content and I also think, say, brother, apart from uh, uh, almost one school, no, so so no. Mm -hmm. I can see some any mm -hmm. any bre bre. So so mo mo bre e wa bra bo mo chira. Say wa kuso bi wa na wa kai. Sorry, I'm sorry. Huh? I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, sorry now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Me to Ghana, love bug. I feel the same way. I think or reply to somebody says something. Mm. Uh -huh. And this one said, land in Ghana is 20,000 on up. Yes. And it's still land, not land in the US. Oh, yes, 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 yes. And it's not still not yours. Yes. Mm -hmm. on you uh, uh, yeah. yeah. It's so true. It is so true. <laughs> yeah. And uh, sister, it's true. Uh, what I was saying about how people don't save their money and hey, me can I retire? I don't know what I call contract is our something and I'm retired. No. I need to get a <laughs> book. <laughs> yes, you need yes. to get Mr. Omen yeah. Aquis book. You're gonna they are on it. Amazon as well, on Kindle. Amazon, yeah. Yes. Kindle. When you type my name, Kapna Obin Aku, you see the books there. Uh, yes yes get the book get the book you will get more wisdom from this guy yeah mm -hmm. i'm telling you <laughs> so mr Milako, what do you have for us so that we can live uh we, there's no way we are going to build our country if you're not positive and the negativity we were programmed like that through the european religion every institution that the european set was designed to put us down yeah so so so, not yeah. forward that's right so everything that they show their tv their governance their school their religion everything they are the top the european yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah and so um if you are so negative towards oh you're so negative towards ghana africa watch again where's the bia would be you should be you my you you're corrupt you cannot correct and penny pack you can come Abrofo, yes, are more in multiples, in thousands. You look at what they are doing in Russia. We have never gone to war to kill another country. Not in history. Africans have never picked guns and gone to war and attack. No, we never. We have that. always been attacked. 
We so then a lot of the bad things don't put them on us. Uh, but I can understand. You were taught that way. Mm -hmm. And you can be retaught to think good. Allow yourself to be retaught. Uh, that's right. Yes. So the, And learn history. And Not learn the history, history taught by Europeans. Learn the history taught by, our, our, um, by us to make us great. Learn. We have never been weak people. It's a lie. Hmm. They came never. to war. They came to fight us. They came mm -hmm. with weapons. Just as you see in Ukraine, that's what happened on the African continent for 400 years. Yep. Constantly under, under invasion, under siege. And they didn't yep. want to go. We fought them to go. Yep. They didn't want to stop. Yep. Even slavery is not because they will stop slavery, because the Africans fought. Yep. So when you are telling the story, don't tell the story to, to our disadvantage. Look for the heroism in our stories. And then study money take care of your money and create wealth and leave something for the next generation leave something well. for the next generation and, and stop following this anointing oil and govern uh, <laughs> and these prophets a lot of them don't see anything they just tell you they see something they don't see anything if you see somebody who hears from god the quality of the truth of god that he preaches will show you the genuineness of his of his spirit a lot of them don't even don't have understanding of god and his principles. Nothing is more important than the lives of people. And hmm. if that person places material things above people, that person cannot be hearing from God. For God is love. So don't be following those people. There's no greater force than love. Nobody can kill you. Why are you afraid? Nobody can kill Nobody. you. Be truthful, be hard working, be loving. Be positive person. Help people. If you want to go to church, no problem. But if they are selling an oil, there, don't go. <laughs> if they are selling Jesus' blood, there, don't go. Those boys, they, they just are cortic. A lot of them are cortic. They practice deep things. It has nothing to do with the gospel of Christ. Don't believe anybody just because they have put prophet on those things. Uh, God, we don't have any prophet over anything. It's not true. The prophecy, prophetic ministry, yes, is there. But these prophets that we have them they call themselves it's not god they, no matter what they say look at their lifestyle you will see that if it's of god or it's not of god we can't have this many prophet and nobody could see covid not covid god could None not tell, could not, not tell any of them like that so liberate yourself religion is enslaving especially the one that we are practicing in africa they have put us and islam is not it's not free from that it's the same you know, you meet an average Islamic person, he doesn't have any African name, he thinks that Saudi Arabia is his, <laughs> he speaks Saudi, you know, <laughs> want to speak Arabic and all this. It's all. They design we all those are, things. To we, are in, we are in deep trouble. Yes. So whether it's Islam or whether it's Christianity, it's the same thing. They took a lot of slaves to Saudi Arabia and they were more litter and they killed a lot of people in the name. Even now, even people. now, you black even person, now, the whole Arabia. world, we are not accepted anywhere, anywhere. except Africa. Yeah. That's right. Go to China and see. It's there. Go to India. Go to America. Go to uh, everywhere. So if you're an African, don't, you cannot look down upon Africa. African-Americans, Jamaicans, they told you lies that Africans don't like you. It's never true. Visit or ask those who have visited and see if they were fought and they were sacked or they were, they, were, they were told that they don't belong. It's never true like that. If you want humanity, Africa, no matter what, we have not lost our humanity. Our humanity. We have not. Black won. people. No. Black people. I always say that. Right. You will see people, Some uh, uh, somebody will go and pick up a gun and go to schools and shoot people. Mm. i never seen a black person. No, don't do that. No. No, don't do black that. Black Americans can yeah. decide to fight themselves and yeah. shoot themselves. And yeah. I mean, California, whatever. But there will, there will be not even one black person person will pick a gun and go to school and school start shooting school. people you see they so will we never him. do that it never yeah. happened never that's right and so um you can't hate africa if you're black if you hate africa and you're black you hate yourself and you'll never see true fulfillment that's it and that's africa it. is not poor if anybody told that africa is poor it's a lie your greatness cannot cannot be cut from africa and uh, if you want if you even if you can't live here Every now and then, take a break. And visit. And come what is happening. And come. And come. So I want to say thank you. Until Tilly. <laughs> thank time. you, brother. Thank you so much because, listen, people listen to you. And 
I, when I'm with you, I, I express myself more because you understand me. You, okay. you know, you, you understand where I'm coming from. If some, so when me if your eyes are not opener and somebody like me coming up saying certain things that you would think say oh boy you're too much or you say what you say but so when you get to a standard a year who, who said i wish you said any probably be who light you know be who light you know now what i say kasa my prayer is that say me no no ma emma dear you know man you emma emma Bra, me come to us, sir. In two now, sorry, I am money, man. Oh, where am I? No, we will be better. Shall we cast, sir? Eh, well, when I did a way down, sorry, one cross, sorry, for what sorry, not for sick after caressing me, 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 sick, and only me tight, no, me, me, boy, will be what God, I mean, you won't go for you today. Oh, God, that's what I'm doing. And you know, me, for me, sick, I'm going to call him. This is what I chose to use my money. That's right. And you know, yeah, can you not say when in the hall? Wouldn't you and your bay for? Oh, my mean your bay for? Oh, be no, I agree. I want your bay for. Oh, be this, I do with you. Are when your bay for live your life. Now, life is so short. And you won't call him the agent of one cast and cast out some pie boy to me for him, bro. A subset who best at here to an amount. And what's right, you bet me. Exactly. Perfect. And you know, brother, I mean, be And I yes, want to thank know. everybody that um came here. Um, and I must do lovely those Africa. Um, South Sister, I can't pronounce your name right. So this one, I have to say. Sonova, yes. Thank you, sister. You were here first. And thank you, thank you for staying. You've been here the, through the whole um, program. We thank you so much for your support. And um, who else? Oh, Sister True. This sister, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Sister, for coming. You were late, but you came. Thanks a lot. We thank you. We thank everybody. If I didn't mention your name, ADBP. Thank you, oh, brother. Thank you. And to know, Minnie Abema, Yamin Shah, baby, what it? With a what? Yamin Shah, sir, on your anama domus no amount in dear to say, Yeah, one fan shall who are so, who may you see a tibby. Now, I was saying, Yeah, or what soon won't ye, says Annie Cano. Sir, who are sweat ye and ya pay for? thank you guys thank you for watching and soon i think tonight or tomorrow morning i'm gonna